information this morning. New York City health officials say they've identified what appears to be a fifth case of monkeypox. It comes as the World Health Organization reports cases have now been found in 26 countries. And later today, the CDC will address the rising number of cases in the United States. CBS News' Elijah Westbrook, live in Long Island City, with more on this. Elijah. Oh, Chris and Mary, this latest possible case of monkey monkeypox, excuse me, comes just actually a couple weeks after the first reported case uh, here in New York City. In fact, the city's health department says it's currently in the process of conducting contact tracing and closely monitoring those who are feeling symptomatic. Now, we know at this hour that monkeypox is most commonly found in Africa and spreads through skin to skin contact. Experts say patients could develop a rash and even lesions. You see there. The World Health Organization has said in the last few days, globally, cases are jumping by the hundreds and presumes many cases are spreading undetected. The good thing that, that the virus is not highly contagious, is not, does not cause severe illnesses in, in most people, and the treatment is just supportive. Now, take a look. Experts say monkeypox can spread between people through physical contact, touching contaminated items like clothing or bedding, saliva, and respiratory droplets. Now, doctors say most patients recover in just a few weeks and are warning folks to not panic because it is not that contagious. But we should mention that the CDC plans on holding a briefing today at noon where we'll learn a lot more about these latest cases. We're live this morning here in Long Island City, Queens. Elijah Westbrook, CBS 2 News. Elijah, thank you.